everyone, Live It Like Lisa here. And in today's video, I thought I would show you how I decorate my tiered trays. I think I did one of these for Christmas and I didn't end up getting to do my Easter one, but I just thought I'd show you how I'm going to decorate the tiered trays I've got here, just with everyday decor for everyday use. Now, if you would have seen my last thrift store haul, you would have seen I've purchased most of these little trinkets and things in that last haul. So I've gathered all the things that I, you know, have in mind to use when decorating this tray. And I've got a few things out here as far as decor pieces and floral and cotton stems that I might use within the pieces. And yeah, so I just thought I'd take you through my process of creating a decorated tiered tray. So I'll just set the camera up and let's get started. And I do apologize for the lawn mowing in the background. It's just inevitable where we live that someone at one stage or another will be lawn mowing every single time I do a video. <laughs> so yeah, I apologize if that's really annoying. Um, so what I like to start with is some of the bigger pieces that I'm going to put on the tray. So I like to start with our W for our last name. You'll probably see me adjusting things here and there as I go. There's no wrong or right way to do it. It's just whatever you feel looks good. So this little one, I'm gonna keep pretty neutral toned as far as like a lot of whites and things like that in this one. You just do start with your bigger, bigger pieces. So here's the finished tray and I try to make it visually pleasing from all angles but obviously you still have like you know the side that you wish to sort of display at the front I guess but yeah I mean it is is so easy like once you've got all your little supplies um, put all of the little things on that you want to display and then just fill in all the gaps with some pine cones faux flowers, potpourri filler. It's super, super easy. I'll take you around the other side just so you can sort of see. Oh, I can do it from here, I guess. Just spin it round. I love the wheat as well. 
So even though it's not as fancy at the back here, there's still other things to look at. Got the little owl there. I'm really happy with that. And I mean, I, I love setting these up for all the different seasons for like, you know, Easter, Christmas and all that, even though I missed out on Easter this year. Got the other little owl stuck in there just as <laughs> a little surprise. But yeah, so that's the first one. And I'll take you and show you the other one. So this one I've got on my um, decor shelf that I always have here. And I normally decorate for all the seasons. But right now it's just pretty plain and simple. So this is my tiered tray for this one. And I kept this one fairly neutral. Nothing really too fancy. Just a lot of filler on there. And my little birds, another little one sitting on there. And again, this one, yeah, I mean, it's still still able to be viewed from different angles, but obviously with it sitting on this shelf, um, there is a, a definite front to it, which I would say would be like that. So I hope you enjoyed this video guys and it gave you some ideas on how you can decorate your own tiered trays and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.